Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Benjamin Magnus Plays Ultimate Generals of the War. We left off having done a couple uh, little, uh, diff little little battles, but they were difficult battles. I mean, I had a little bit of trouble with them, but now we're back to uh, back into the main game. Uh, Battle of Antietam. Looks like we got a minus five, a minus two point five, and is bigger in effect. Huh. Okay. Okay, let's go. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. Attack left, attack center, attack right, and then reserves. All right, so uh, Robert E. Lee entered the state of Maryland on September 3rd, 1863. His intention is to take the war into Union territory, and we cannot allow that. We must move to intercept Lee, and, per and, he, per and he prepares to meet our army in the town of Sharpsburg, creating a solid, defensive, uh, solid defense behind Antietam Creek. So uh, I consolidated what I had into two cores instead of those three. Um... Thinking, I'm gonna go for the left. You no, know what I'm gonna do? Uh, I'm gonna put the first corp in this first core in the center. I'm gonna t attack the left with the second core because I don't like the looks of that actual creek here. I like the looks of this area. I can't. I'm in the same situation I was last time, wasn't I? Shit! I gotta go back. All right, so now we have three core. So the first core, uh, I'm gonna put the. Oof. This looks like the toughest area. See, now I've got the, the 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 thought in my head. Do I want to put my my best guys where I think the tough fight is going to be the toughest, or put my best guys where I think I can affect a breakthrough better? All right, sir. Second and, you know what? No, screw that. Uh, third core on the left. Second core on the right. Whew! I guess that's what we're going in with. The Confederate have chosen to face our army near the town of Sharpsburg. The nearest bridge to the town is possibly going to be very well defended, so we need to act with caution. Most likely, the Confederates will have their right flank deployed here. That's the bridge. Hell of a pan. Wow. Wow. We can cross the Antietam Creek from several other passages, but there is danger of a Confederate ambush or artillery bombardment from the nearby hills. The safest route to the town and the Confederate defensive line is from the north. From here, we can launch our first attack with more safety. Is this, I hope this is going to be broken up into smaller battlefields and then... Coalesced. The rebels have possibly hidden some forces behind this hill, so we need to secure it first. Confederate infantry has been detected hiding in these woods. Confederate line is possibly stretched through these woods to the east. The area around there is wow, they're giving a lot of information here. I think this is one big battlefield. The reconnaissance found that the Confederate center is situated at the sunken road and is heavily defended with several artillery batteries. Here's the town of Sharpsburg. The town is covered all the way to the west by the Potomac River. If we manage to block this road, the Confederates will be cut off from their reinforcements so we'll have a chance to surround and completely destroy them. Alright, this is... Our divisions are preparing to attack this dawn. Brace yourself, General, is going to be a hard fight. Yeah, no shit. I have no... I, I seriously hope this is just a series of smaller engagements that coalesce into a big one, not just one huge one, because I'll be overwhelmed. The first attack wave will advance south. That's pretty good, because I my, my north is stronger than my south. These woods are defended by Confederate infantry. Their numbers are unknown. It would be a good idea to secure the hill. It can become a dangerous artillery platform for the Confederates. Our main goal is to capture the Dunker Church. Yeah, it is cut off, I just noticed. Uh, for further advance towards the town of Confederate Center. My God, this is just so many pop-ups telling me what's going on. The rebel positions are going to be reinforced continuously from the south. We need to act fast and gain the momentum. 
General, if you find stiff resistance, it is advised to hold a good defensive position and wait for the rest of our forces, which will be ready for to attack in two hours. All right, everybody, here we are. Uh, after I got a look at the battlefield, I actually decided to go back and change the outlook of my my army's makeup. Uh, I What I kind of did was try to mix in my experienced units with my inexperienced units. Um, so that I didn't have, really, you know, like one core that was just flailing impotently at the enemy while Bob and Midge and like Oddball just rampage through the enemy ranks. I didn't think that was going to be a, a good idea. So I mixed everybody together to try to get a better balance. And let's see, um, start battle. Here we go. I feel like I don't have any sound. Nope, there it is. All right, I just had to do up my thingy. So we've got the hill over here that we should try to take as an artillery uh, position. And then we've got the the farm. Is it church? Nicodemus Hill and Dunker Church. So this church is going to be a bitch and a half, I think, because look at all the goddamn cover. There's woods to the left. There's woods to the right. There's fields and fences and farms in the center. Like, look at this. All this cover. All this cover. So, oh yeah, and then over here is where they'll be getting reinforcements from. So, ah, uh, shit. I just realized I didn't put a single bit, no, I, I do have, I thought I had artillery in here. I could set a division on AI control? That's a thing? Okay, well, apparently I forgot about artillery. But what we'll do is we'll take the hill with, uh, well, let, let's do this. Let's scout the hill. Go straighter. Here, go this way. And just come up behind it. Um, hopefully that doesn't come back to bite me on the ass. Onzo, straight up and start scouting. Um, Burnside, Lewark, and Dillinger, which are some of my better units. Right over here, please. Rhino... Weeks and yellow, which are a good mix of units. I want you guys over this way. I have no idea where the enemy is going to be, so I'm just going to try to keep you kind of towards the center. And we're going to go. Like, I, I, I spent all this time moving units around, and then apparently I was, I was more... Uh, I paid more attention to the distributes of distribution of experience you can ob obviously see like i have i have rhino which is three star i have um yellow uh, and burnside which is one star i have lewark and dillinger which is two star I've got onzo i ooh. Our, our cavalry on cavalry shit straighter move in to uh melee Come on, get right in there. There we go. They got carbines. You should tear them to pieces. Oh, fuck. They've got twice as much cavalry as me. But we, we decimated that one pretty good. No, no, not so good. Okay, they routed and I'm running. Well, I mean, we messed that guy up. We busted him up. So let's move uh, some infantry over this way. I don't know, that wasn't... Oh! Uh, shot in the ass like that didn't do him any good. Straighter's already taken 50% casualties. Anzo hasn't seen anybody yet, so... I love the skirmishers. They're my favorite units. More of our units can advance. Uh, which is just some more snippers. Here, come down this way. I didn't... Oh! Hello! I say, just open. Oh wow, really? That's it. <laughs> One hit out of five hundred bullets. Yeah, they're dug in on the. Uh, it looks like the these fences are actually well, at least for the AI, usable as um the like protracted cover. Here, can we get these two? That's a waste of bullets trying that. Shoot the horses. All 
I mean, that's an open shot right there. There you go. That was a little bit better. <gasps> oh, look what I found. Oh, there's some artillery. Rhino, I need you, you up here. Straighter. Come on, quick like a bunny. Well, I they messed up my cavalry. I messed up their cavalry. Shit happens. Um, yeah, these three guys, I'd like to move this way. Like so. I was really hoping to capture their supplies. That would have been awesome. No, I don't want you to shoot them. I want... Oh, okay. Well, if, if, if they're just gonna... If they're gonna run... Nothing. Not a, that's such a waste of bullets. You think I can get it? Here. Let's move these guys over this way. Early looks like... I mean, that... the f Fuck! There are guys in these woods here. Oh, shit. I hate it when that happens. What are the odds that this is going to be a good shot? Got 12 casualties for that. This that these these fences using them as the the def, you know, the actual defensive bonus cover thingy. Gotta hate that. Uh, straighter. Okay, so this hill is unoccupied. Dillinger is gonna get messed up here. Burnside, move down here. I don't know. It's just I don't know what to do other than just stand there and take it for a while. Oh, and there's another one. Kind of guns you guys got, sharps rifles. So, just fire. See what you could do. They got that cavalry around, which is the which is the issue I'm seeing right now. And these these Louisiana tigers sitting in here. Every, every 500 bullets, we get one one hit for 500 bullets. This guy's already taken 140 losses. That's trying to really whittle this one down. It's the only thing I could think to do is just sit there and whittle that one down. You know what? Move up to... Nah, I, that's a, is this going to be better or worse if we move up to cover? All right, let's move these guys down here and get some flanking going. The Louisiana Tigers gotta fucking go, but I don't know how to do that. How does this not count as flanking fire? This is a slaughter. I, I I'll say I'll, I've said it before, and I will say it again. There's nothing I hate more than woods in this game because it's like putting your guys in a impenetrable steel bunker. All right, you're not any good over there. I need you elsewhere. Well, it's it's like putting your guys in an impenetrable steel bunker if you're the AI. I mean, look at this. It's it's like 6,000 bullets per volley, and we're not doing anything. Here, get a good shot. At fire, fire. Come on, please tell me you're within range. Damn it. Straighter's down here. There's artillery in these woods, which is fuck. Yeah, there it is. Told you there's artillery in those woods. We just gotta take out one of these guys.
You know what? We're doing it. Before, before we sit there and just, before they eat through all of our, ooh, the St Stonewalls Brigade. I hate those guys. Before they eat through all of my men just sitting there plucking away at them, we're just gonna charge them with the units we do have available. And then we can flank this position. And look, oh, they actually did some damage against the Louisiana Tigers here. Ugh. Come on, guys. Why are we not firing? And how come that counts as flanked for me, but not for them? Why are you not firing? We're gonna lose this. Here, get into the woods down here. There's their artillery. Trying, trying to shoot that, uh, that general, but it's not doing anything. I mean, look at this. This is crazy. Thirty-one kills for half their ammunition. Stonewall Brigade is in the o is in the open here. There's no way they should be able to survive shots like this. That's what I wanted to see. Somebody fucking dying finally. They retreated. They were. I cannot. How is this possible? Literally 10 to 1 odds. Literally 10 to 1. And not only did you lose. I will never understand melee in this game. Never, ever, ever will I understand how melee in this game works. Hood's division spotted coming from the south. Yep, that's what I was worried about, is they told me there'd be reinforcements from the south. Like, when 175 men can hold up thousands, I think there's something fucking, something fucking, fucking fuck fuck going on. Some fucking fuck fuck. Alright. We're doing okay. Some people are retreating. I'm pissed, but some people are- oh god. I thought it was just like one division, or just one regiment. How are we- how- how are you not killing these people? How? How, 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 how? Shoot the- shoot the arty. Shoot the arty. Unfortunately, we gotta take these shots. He's getting, he's getting hit really bad by the artillery now. Come on, just break these, this last unit. Shoot them.
Oh, he's dead. Alright, so you need to form up, like, right here. Oh, and these guys are in the impenetrable woods. Alright, we were out of those guys, which is good. Finally. Oh god, there's another fence line. Oh, why are you retreating? Straighter, go get him. Alright, finally getting some hits in there. Attack Sunken Road. Okay. Is this the second part of the battle, or what's going on? This is where I'm attacking. First wave attack revealed the intention of the competitors to hold their line and defend the town. We must now send the rest of our forces down the valley. Dunkirk Hurst must be held to clear the left flank of the Confederates. The Sunken Road is an important position. The rebels will probably defend it with strong forces. We should advance and push them away. Does this mean I get more people? We have forces waiting from this side of the river. We can use them to harass the Confederate right flank. According to our chronicles, the rebels have more forces available, but we don't know if they will... They are now held in reserve, or they are still en route, marching from Harper's Ferry. General, act with caution. All right, now we have a much bigger battlefield to work with, which scares me. And these are the... These are, again, not my best units. Hmm. River is heavily defended. No shit. Rear flanked? No, you're not. Come on, open fire on these fuckers. Where are you going? Seriously, where is this guy going? Go follow him. Oh, Jesus Christ, I hate that so much. Oh, they did the, the zoomy thing again. Here's Strader. I got a cat sitting in front of my monitor blocking half my view right now. Stonewall's Brigade. Jeez, where'd you come from? Oh my god, look how fast they are! Jesus Christ, there's somebody over here, too. How are these guys holding? Like, this guy? How are you? How are you doing that? Spotted! Open fire! So we're gonna try to flank these guys. Oh shit. Well, we're gonna try to flank them. Get our horsies up here. Our army is advancing to assault the rebel center. Who is this? Oh my god, these are some of my good guys. Gamma! The one and only. 
Straighter, I need you back here. I don't know how the Texas Brigade is doing as well as it is. Or this asshole Douglas here. Stonewall Brigade. God damn it. They formed back up. You know what? I gotta have to cut this here because the cat is literally blocking half my screen right now and I can't see what the fuck I'm doing. So thanks for watching, everybody. If you have enjoyed, don't forget to drop a like, leave those comments, and I will see you guys next time.